What's up everyone? It's Kevin the Mac Expert here with a video for you, a demonstration of the iPhone 4 Retina display. So the iPhone 4 Retina display is amazing. It's got double the amount of pixels and it's got uh, a huge pixel density, much much greater than the old iPhone or the old iPod Touch. So I just wanted to make this video to show you how cool and let you judge the quality of the iPhone 4's Retina display. So we're going to do it, run a couple tests and Hopefully you can judge the quality and see how it looks. The pixels are very, very sharp. and So I'm going to go through some pictures, watch some videos, and look at some apps to give you a sample of how the iPhone 4's Retina display looks in real life usage. Let's say you were playing a game such as Doodle Jump. The iPhone 4 and the enhanced graphics of apps by developers make the iPhone 4 look great and display apps beautifully on the new retina display. So I just wanted to give you a sample of how Doodle Jump works and how it looks on the brand new retina display. So a combination of the screen and a combination of the developers upping their resolutions for the game make it look tremendous and stunning gameplay. And the quality is really, really outstanding. Just to give you an idea. Splinter Cell Conviction is a game optimized for the iPhone 4 Retina display, so let's take a look at some of the graphics for an app optimized specifically for the iPhone 4. Let's take a look. Hopefully this will give you a sample of some of the graphics in the new iPhone 4 Retina display for a game optimized specifically for the iPhone 4. I think it's tremendous and the quality as you hold it in your hand is really amazing. They've really done, the developers have done an excellent job of turning these iPhone apps into tremendous apps for the iPhone 4. This gives you a quick sense of the gameplay quality on the iPhone 4's Retina display. So here I'd like to give you an example of the text and how the iPhone 4's retina display makes a difference in reading texts, such as the New York Times. Let's take a close look at the articles, and let's tap on this. And as you can see, it's very, very clear. The pictures come in exceptionally well, and the text, you, you can't even see the individual pixels. The text is very, very sharp, much sharper than the old iPhone or iPod Touch. The whole display is amazing and all the text and the pictures are very 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 sharp and it's a great experience to read on the iPhone 4 in an article or an app such as New York Times so to give you a sense of the quality of a web page let's go ahead and load up NewYorkTimes.com hopefully this will give you an idea of how the pictures and the text looks like when you're viewing a web page in Safari I'm going to zoom up very closely so you can see that the quality is tremendous. The quality is outstanding. It's, it's just excellent. It's an excellent experience. And the iPhone 4 is very responsive. The text, the text and the pictures just look excellent. So browsing a site is easy, easy, easy. And it looks great on the new iPhone 4. And to give you an idea of how some of the regular apps look on the iPhone 4, even Calendar looks amazing, and it's been updated for the iPhone 4 to have clear, concise, and exceptional graphics for the iPhone 4 Retina display. Just so here's the lock and unlock screen, and the quality of the display is vibrant, and the colors are just sharp and concise and clear and bursting with color, which make it an all-around amazing, amazing screen on the phone. Here's a sample of how the Facebook app looks on the new iPhone 4. Like many other apps, it's been updated to have clear, concise, and vibrant graphics, all on the new iPhone 4's Retina display. So the iPhone's 4 Retina display is amazing, and the quality of the screen is so good that I would recommend the phone solely for the purpose of the Retina display. The screen is such good quality that it's a major selling point for the phone. The resolution is 960 by 640, and many of the apps and music and videos and games, everything looks amazing on the brand new iPhone 4's Retina display. 
For more videos, check out youtube.com slash themacexpert. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.